Hello, good morning everyone. Today's topic is about drug abuse. What is a drug? Drug is organic or in inorganic substance which is given to a, a patient as a medicine. But if that uh, substance is not used for medicinal purpose, instead a person takes it without any prescription of doctor, he becomes uh, he or she becomes addicted to that particular substance and those substances have the ability to alter the mood it, it changes psychology it, it 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 interferes with the central nervous system also it can stimulate the body it can relax the body there are many effects so that those are regarded as mood altering substances which are self administered so without doc doctor's prescription uh, a particular person will be uh, self-administering it into the body and that is called drug abuse. Drug uh, which is abused, they or the drugs belong to or there are of four types. Depressants, opiate narcotics, stimulants and hallucinogens. In this video, let us learn about depressants. First group of drug. As the name itself indicates, they depress the brain activity. Uh, there are two groups of depressants, sedatives and tranquilizers. What's the difference between sedative and a tranquilizer? Sedative is a depressant which when it is taken, it will bring about calmness and relaxation of central nervous system. So who will be taking it? One who is having stress, anxiety problem will be taking these sedatives uh, and it brings about calmness. Uh, high doses if it is given it will bring about uh, sleep so those who are having sleep uh, problems they will also uh, take up sedatives with the doctor's prescription but without prescription if it is continued to take person becomes addicted if he tries to leave that particular drug uh, his body will have to face uh, symptoms called withdrawal symptoms they how do they work these uh, depressants work by increasing efficiency of um, GABA receptors in the brain or in the nervous system there is a receptor known as sorry GABA amino butyric acid these are the receptors of GABA neurotransmitter which is an inhibitor neurotransmitter uh, when that uh, when that new GABA neurotransmitter binds to GABA receptor, it will lower the anxiety, it will lower the uh, tension. That's how if the sedatives are given, they increase the affinity of the GABA receptor so that ga GABA neurotransmitter binds and brings down all the activity like calmness and relaxation. Uh, now, what are the examples for sedatives? barbiturates they are commonly used in sleeping pills because they induce sleep what are tranquilizers tranquilizers are also depressant they lower the tension and anxiety but they are given in low dose, dosages hence they won't induce sleep example benzodiazepine for that example is valium these are the two groups of drug now overall difference between sedative and tranquilizer is Sedative when it is given to a uh, person or an animal, it will slow down body activity. A uh, sort of person won't be mobile or agile when sedatives are given. Okay. Whereas tranquilizer given in low dosages, it will just bring about uh, lower the tension and anxiety. So this is the first group of drug known as depressants.